Hey everybody, welcome back. I've been waiting for this moment for a long time and I want to talk to you about the Autel Evo 2 Pro 6K, but not before a word from our sponsors, me. A little bit of non-monetized humor, I thought you'd enjoy that. Uh, got the Autel Evo 2 Pro 6K and I bought it from the refurbished section from Autel and it was about $500 cheaper than buying them brand new. So I took a chance because it says that it has to operate as new. Might have to look past some minor blemishes or scratches but I was willing to do so to save $500. But I got it and there was nothing wrong with it so I flew it. It's probably something that Autel wouldn't have noticed anyway if somebody just returned it. They put it on their refurbished shelf and they sent it to me and it did have a defect, but it would have helped that the customer had told them what the thing was doing so they could actually fix it. So they probably never even got a chance to fix it. But I noticed that it was falling out of focus pretty much 50% of the time, no matter what mode I was in. So I sent it back and they investigated it and found out that it just needed a new camera and a gimbal. So I get it back. And not only does it have brand new props on it, it doesn't even have the standard props that came with it before, it's got the silent blades that I'd already bought for myself, so now I've got two sets of brand new silent blades, brand new camera, brand new drone, and for $500 cheaper. So if that's something that you'd be interested in, please go check out the refurbished section because it can save you a lot of money. It's been raining in Florida so much lately and I just had to try to find a window of opportunity to fly. My neighbor has also had the same issue. He just bought the Air 2 uh, from DJI and I recommended that to him and he is loving this thing. And so I called him up and I said, hey, let's go Let's take an opportunity to go fly a little bit. We've got a couple hours window where there's no rain. Now you can see where we're flying. There's going to be water puddles and everything everywhere. And we had to jump over a lot of puddles to get to the track where we were at at the high school. But once we got there, we had such a great time. I was able to get some autonomous mode features video out of this. And I was also able just to get some raw footage. I filmed it all in log and I color graded it. And I liked it so much I figured I'd take this as an opportunity to share with you a video montage of our flight yesterday. So here, check it out.
So I hope you enjoyed this. This drone is exactly what I wanted. I had the Mavic 2 Pro. I just, then know they're coming out with the Mavic 3. The, pri the price is probably gonna be astronomical. And I am concerned about that. So I took a chance with this one because I'd seen so many rave reviews about the 6K video quality and their customer service and their constant firmware updates. And yes, it looks like a giant school bus when it's flying and I love it. I mean, it's, it's a really cool company and the customer service is great. So I can appreciate a lot of the flight characteristics of this and it's constantly being updated and, and improved. So I love this drone. It's probably my favorite drone of all time now and it's gonna be with the family for a long time. So it helps with my fleet because I also have the Air 2S from DJI and also have the Mini 2. And I use the Lift Thor mount adapter that I use for my triple tech tablet, which is a 1200 nit tablet. And you've seen a couple of my other videos. I talk about this tablet. I can't speak highly enough about it. It works great because I can put all the apps for any type of drone on it and then just unplug it from this, plug it into the other remote and boom, you're off to the races and it's controlling everything. And I don't have to worry about it dimming when I go outside iPhone and it stays bright and it's amazingly clear and it's very responsive. It's very sturdy. You can drop it up to five feet and it won't break. The case is built in around this thing. So I love the triple tech tablet and I highly recommend it. So enough of that. If you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe and hit that like button notification bell, most importantly, because I'm going to be doing a lot of reviews on this. And every time I go out and find something new, I'm going to share that with you. So if you're interested in that or anything media related and you're not a subscriber, subscribe, please help out the channel. I'm doing this full time and I'm doing this for us. So thanks for watching and I'll see you all next week. Bye.